What's up guys? Welcome to my channel. Today we're going to be solving a programming interview question called Remove all adjacent duplicates in string. This is considered an easy question and the problem description goes like this. Given a string S of lowercase letters, a duplicate removal consists of choosing two adjacent and equal letters and removing them. We repeatedly make duplicate removals on S until we no longer can. Return the final string after all such duplicate removals have been made. It is guaranteed that the answer is unique. Here they give us an example. The input is a string of A, B, B, A, C, A, and the output is C, A, because in A, B, B, A, C, A, we could remove B, B, since the letters are adjacent and equal, and this is the only possible move. The result of this move is the string A, A, C, A, of which only A, A is possible, so the final string is C, A. So they removed two duplicates, and the first one was BB and the second one was AA, and the result was CA. To solve this problem, we are going to mimic a stack using a list in Python. And a stack is a data structure where the last item that gets put into the stack will be the first item that gets returned to us. And this is similar to a pile of books. When you have a pile of books and you put another book in, the last book that you put in will be the first book that gets returned to you. Here we have an example of how we are going to use stacks in order to solve this problem. Suppose we have an input string of ABB. We initialize a stack and then we loop through the input. And if the stack is empty, we are just going to push that item into the stack. And then we go to our second letter, which is B. Uh, now we're going to peek the stack. And peeking the stack means that we check for the top item in the stack. And remember that our top item in the stack is going to be our last item in the list. So we've checked for that item and see if the peaked item in the stack is equal to our current letter. And if it does not equal to our current letter, we can push that letter onto the stack. But if it does equal to that current letter, so in this case, uh, we have a peaked stack of a B and then a current letter is also B. If they are equal, then we have to pop that item from the stack so that we can prevent the adjacent duplicates. All right, let's code out the algorithm in Python. First, we're going to initialize the stack as an empty list. Now we're going to go through all of the items in the input string. Let's create a variable to store the length of the stack as we'll be using it later. And let's check and see if the length of the stack is greater than zero or if the stack is not empty. And if the stack is not empty, we will also have to check and see if the item in the input string is equal to the peaked item in the stack. So if i is equal to stack at length of stack minus one, and stack at length of stack minus one will give us the last item in the list. And the last item in the list is the first item in the stack, which is the peaked item in the stack. So if those two items are equal, we have to pop the stack because that would mean that there are adjacent duplicates and we want to get rid of that. And otherwise we would just push or append that item into the stack. Now we just have to return the string version of that stack and let's run the code. And in our output, we see that we removed all of the adjacent duplicates. So that is how we solve uh, remove all adjacent duplicates in the string. So in the end, we solve this problem by mimicking a stack using a list in Python. If you guys like this approach, please give me a thumbs up, or if you have any questions, please comment down below. Please don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, and see you in the next tutorial. Bye.